hey folks, I'm here with uh, Ethel. She retired in 1993. One more time. Hi folks, I'm here in Oro Bottle, Nevada to introduce the next segment of Reclamation Road. A winery pays in the range of six to seven hundred dollars for each coopered barrel. A few years down the road, all of a sudden they cannot use it anymore. And here, in fact, is another way to repurpose wine tank. From tiny acorns do mighty oaks grow, and for the past 2,000 years, vintners have used the resulting mature oak wood to finish the flavors of their fine wines. Napa's Robert Mondavi is credited with experimenting with various oaks and barrel styles, although aging wine in oak stems from before the birth of the Roman Empire, and we know they like their wines. Oak aging profoundly affects the color, flavor, tannin, profile, and texture of the wine. Oak chips or oak staves, also known as flavor sticks in our lingo, are used in great stainless steel tanks to flavor it with oak. Wooden barrels made of French white oak last from five to seven years, the barrels imparting additional qualities to wine through evaporation and low level exposure to oxygen. Wine barrel making, called wet cooperage, is a job for the finest craftsman or cooper. Only the best wood, generally found in oaks 100 years old or better, is used. The French, of course, prefer the French white oak, but we also make tanks here in America out of white oak. The oak is then hand split to preserve the grain, fashioned into staves and seasoned for several years before being finished, assembled in metal hoops, fired and toasted over fire before turned into a custom barrel. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where your wine sits if your winery loves you. Reclamation rules come to your town.